Hi everyone, in this video I am going to show you how to contact Apple support. You might need to contact Apple support and you might need to chat with a live agent one on one because you might have the problem that you are not able to uh, solve by yourself. Then in that case you might need to contact the Apple support team. So here I am going to show you how you can contact apple support and how you can chat with them and you can resolve your problem in that way so uh, i had a problem with my ipad that uh, it was disabled because i entered my passcode uh, wrong and uh, there was multiple attempts of wrong passcode that's why the ipad was logged completely and i even uh, did not remember my apple id passcode that's why i was unable to recover my ipad it was completely shut down and there was an error message displayed on the screen that your ipad has been disabled and i went to the apple uh, help uh, website there were a lot of informations but uh i was not able to use uh, any of those uh, information because uh, one thing is i also forget my apple id and uh, that's the reason i was not able to uh, follow any of the instruction and only option i had was i had to contact apple support and they would be able to resolve that issue so that was my problem that's why i uh, tried to contact them and i found how you can contact apple support here it is so to contact them uh, i searched in google that i forget my apple uh, ipad passcode so um, the apple website it give this information and i went through all the information so there was all the steps that i need to take to recover my ipad but because i also had my apple id passcode forgotten so i was not able to use it uh, this information but if you remember your apple id uh, and its password then you would be able to use that information but in if you are in a similar situation where you are unable to uh, where you forget your uh, apple id passcode also then follow these steps now you have to select the device where you have the problem once you after you select that device and if you go down then you will see two options whether you can chat with them or you can call them so i choose to chat with them and uh, in these boxes we have to provide our personal information name and email address those kind of things and once we continue then the chat box will open and you will be now able to chat with the uh, apple support team and you can explain every problem that you, that you have and they will definitely help resolve this problem so in this way i contacted apple support and you can also do that that was all for today's video thank you so much for watching i will see you in the next video thanks